Hey guys, it's me, Poppy Green, here coming to you with a new video. Ow. Today's video is going to be a t-shirt haul update since you guys haven't seen a lot of my t-shirts since the last time I did one. Um, I have lots of new t-shirts. Some I rescued from clothes that I was going to sell or donate. Um, some... I thrifted, some daddy bought me. So the first one I'm gonna show you is this one that I'm currently wearing. It's, it's a Star Wars, it's got Baby Yoda on it. It says protect, attack, and you can't really see the bottom of it very well. The bottom says snack, give you kind of a close up. Two faces are, so here's the first face, the second face, and then this face, whoops, bottom face, sorry. It's kind of hard to show you guys because I'm wearing it. But, um, Daddy actually got this for me at his work. In case you don't know, Daddy works at Five Below. He went one day with his brother. His brother had a job interview there. He went with him and decided to do some shopping while he was waiting for his brother to be at a job interview. Next, we have, and this is a adult... I, this is either a small or a small medium, I'm not sure. We have this one, which is a Good Luck Trolls brand. This is an extra small. This is from the Teen Department of Wall Walmart. Looks like so. It says Trolls on the bottom. It's shorter in the front and longer in the back. That one's super cute. Like that one. Next, we have this shirt that I got from Romley. This is a size small. It's oversized, but it's super comfy, super loose fit. It's checkered, it's lightweight. It's a little see-through, but not bad. It's got different color trackers. It's got black, baby pink, mint green, yellow, like a light blue color. It's got a more brighter pink on the back. Um, it's got some, as you can see, it's got some white checkers on it too. So this is super cute. Really like this one, this one's super comfy. I wear this one quite a bit. Then we have this one that I thrifted. I don't know, there's no tag on this to tell me the size or the brand. But they have another one that I want from Wish. It's the same material, it's like the same shirt, but it's like different colors. So really, it's, it's color black. It's got the baby pink here, the little yellow pocket, purple on this sleeve, blue on the other. It's a little heavier. It's not like so heavy, but it's a little heavier. So it's good for like winter time. The sleeves are a little bit longer. This one is a, let me tell you, this is a small medium from Walmart, from the teen section. It says, when your song comes on, it's just a basic black shirt with Baby Yoda on it. That's when your song comes on. In case you guys couldn't tell, I love Baby Yoda. Um, if you guys watch one of my videos, there's a box opening for my Baby Yoda doll. Here's a kitty that wanted to come join. She likes climbing in the boxes, in the drawers. Next, we have another Walmart find. This one I've had for a little while. This is Wonder Nation brand, which for Walmart is a really good brand. For a low quality brand. If you want a low quality brand and you don't want to shop online, I highly recommend. Two brands are Cat and Jack, which is low to mid quality, depending on if where you get them, because you can find Cat and Jack really cheap on like Poshmark and stuff. But it's I mean a little bit more unless you find stuff on sale, like T-shirts and shorts and like leggings and stuff are super cheap. But the dresses and like other rompers and jackets stuff are more higher end. They're like in the middle range. Um, 
This says, all I want is Wi-Fi and fries. This is, like I said, a Walmart One Donation shirt. Got that last summer. This one I thrifted. It's got some white stuff on it. I think that might be like fuzz or something. It says, smart, strong, and sensual. It's supposed to be a play on the Rosie the Riveter sign, but it's Tina from Bob's Burgers, who I actually did a, me and my ex one year did Tina and Gina's burger costume for Halloween. Super cute. She kind of ruined her costume by putting huge bushy eyebrows on, but it was pretty cute. So we have that one that I thrifted. Um, this is just Bob's Burger brand. And it's a size extra small, Ripple Junction. This one again, I thrifted. This is a so perfect soft, so perfect to you, perfect activity tea. I can't remember where this brand is sold. I've seen this brand somewhere. This is kind of lightweight. It's got the longer in the back, shorter. See, the back has like pink on it, the rest of it's black. It says, dance to your own beat. These are kind of like um, sticky, like iron on, and glitter does not come off, which I really like about this. So I love glitter, but I hate when it comes off. It's, um, again, it's lightweight because it's made for like activities and stuff. It's not really see through, so you're good. This is a 14, 16 XL from kids. Right. Yeah, six, sorry, 16. So, yeah, XL. Kid sizes are weird. Sometimes XL is 14, 16. Sometimes XL is just 16. The 2X is 18, which is like plus size, which I can't really wear in kids. Sometimes I can, but typically not. Next, we have a Cat and Jack shirt from Target. Again, like I said, if you're looking for a cheaper to mid range, a mid range. Like, like I said, I'll have their leggings are about five to ten dollars, depending. Their shorts are between five and ten dollars. Their t-shirts and like mid sleeve shirts and long sleeve shirts are typically between. T-shirts are typically about five. The mid sleeve and long sleeve shirts are typically, I think, about. I can't remember. It's somewhere between five and ten. But they're super good quality, and they have a money back guarantee. If you have any issues with them, as long as you have the receipt, Target will honor it and return it if you get a hole in it or anything like that so you have this one it's just got a cute kawaii little stack of blueberry pancakes again favorite thing about it glitter does not come off it's a, te it's a pretty teal color this is a 1416 from i told you where did i tell you i bought that one from target this is another one daddy got me from his work this is a extra small, because their sizes are kind of weird, and these are, I, I'm not sure if these are men's or unisex, I think they're men's. So this said the Mandalorian, and the child, it's got it in English and Japanese. Um, not, I mean, I like this, because this is like the style container he came in, when I bought my one like his box but overall i'm not overly impressed with this one but hey it's a pop account still um baby yoga the next shirt i rescued from my donate giveaway pile i don't remember if i bought this i can't remember if this was target or walmart but this is an lol shirt was gonna get rid of this. This is a 1416. It says, Making my debut. Go LOL. Um, I actually have, I believe I have Majorette, and I don't have the other two. That's um, Teacher's Pet and Sis, or not Sis Cheer. I um, can't remember what her name is. Not Sis Cheer. Sis Cheer is the other one your babe I think or something like that but yeah I mean oh sorry I'm trying to kill myself here. 
So I have that one. Um, I just want to preface it. Preface it, guys. A lot of my shirts are children's sizes because I am so little. I sit really weird sometimes in teen clothes. I can't really wear. women's a lot of times um because a lot of times like i'm in between sizes like i'll be like a medium in teens will be too big but a small will be too small or like really weird and um i do once the blue moon wear boys clothes or men's um i've been on the hunt for a pirate shirt maybe something with like a pirate like map on it or something which i thought little boys Summertime, they'd be wearing pirates. Yeah, no, apparently that's not a thing anymore. But anyways, next shirt we have is another five below find from Daddy. This is a small medium. This has the same picture as that one black shirt I showed you. This one says, "When the beat drops." Same picture. Daddy forgot that I he had bought me that one, but it's just got Yoda and it's gray. Again, it's oversized. Sometimes oversized ones are good. And this one isn't like, I wish this one was like a tad shorter. Like I like them typically, like I like my shirts to either cover like my belt loops or if I like them oversized, it's usually like right to the end of the pockets, but whatever. This shirt I got from Forever 21 for Pride. Forever 21 closed in our mall a year ago pride i wore this so i did a whole 90s theme for pride because i had because we i had to go late to pride because i had a it was world doll day so i had doll club and i was doing a 90s theme 90 90s theme dolls for world doll day so i did a 90s theme pride outfit my girlfriend looked absolutely killer. The dress I got her was not as bright as I'd wanted it to be, but it looked killer on her. We ended up going to Hibachi for dinner. We did fireworks. It was great. So this is a more like crop. It's not, I'm short, so it's not fully crop top. It's supposed to be a crop top. Just a basic rainbow shirt. That was super cute. Um, I really like that one. That looks cute under like romper dresses and stuff. This one is another Cat and Jack Target find. I couldn't resist. The balloon animals are just super cute. It, the shirt's my favorite color, hot pink. And unicorns. And a pink unicorn at that. So I thought this was super cute. Again, this is an extra large. And Cat and Jack. I think only once have I bought something that was Cat and Jack brand. Then I got an extra large and it was too big on me. Normally I wear extra larges in Cat and Jack brand. This is another teen section of Target find around Valentine's. I'm not a huge fan of Care Bears, but Care Bears are super cute. Like, I'd rather have like stuff with Care Bears on it than like actual Care Bears. I had a rainbow one, but I gave it to my ex. But I got this one. This is a, sorry, I think this is like probably small. Yeah, typically with Walmart teen section, I typically get a small, sometimes I get a medium. So I got this. It is kind of see-through. So you have to be a little bit careful with this one. It is lighter weight. It just has like the conversation heart candies. And I don't, if you guys know the name of that bear, let me know. I don't know. I only know like sunshine bear and chair bear. Like, I only know a couple names of bears. Not really big in Care Bears, as I mentioned. Next shirt I have is a Walmart find. This is the brand, again, Wonder Nation, extra large. I absolutely love this shirt. At my girlfriend's, I have a blanket that has the same kitty on it. It's white, it's like a off white, sparkly cat. This? Not cactus, but cactus. I have a, that blanket. So I have two. I have three blankets over at her house. I have one that 
he needs to get, that they need to get rid of. That I don't like. It's one of those ones that has a pillow attached and it's like sleeping bag. So I hate it. It's gay. I don't use it. And then I have my Rainbow Kitty one. If you saw my birthday haul, you would know my story of how I ended up with two of those blankets. I took one over there and then my cat this one. The next shirt I have, I got off of Wish, no, Poshmark. I think this is just like a basic Walmart brand, an extra large. I have not yet worn it, but it's sparkly. It's got like, cause for how, cause last year, a year ago Halloween, I had this thing where I was going to do a Halloween outfit every day for the whole month of October. Halloween, uh, Thanksgiving outfit every day for the month of November. An Easter outfit for whatever month Easter was in that year. And then a Christmas outfit for the whole month of December. That did not happen. So I got this one. That one was super cute. Um, actually, that was the one I did wear. I think it's the other one I saved that I didn't wear. This one I got in a bag of free stuff. That I got off Craigslist. I ended up, or off of Marketplace, I think, on Facebook. I ended up getting rid of most of them. One or two of the items I gave, they were not the sizes they told me, and they ended up fitting my boyfriend's niece. So I think it was her, but it says, Sorry, not sorry. This is Children's Place, a 2X, which is size 16. I think that's super cute. Just kind of basic, kind of plain. This next shirt I got from Romwe. It's one of my mom's favorite things that I bought from Romwe ever. Graphic is not the greatest on here. It's really lightweight, it's a small. Graphic close up is kind of fuzzy. From far away, it's fine. And from here, you can't really tell. If I hold it up closer, it's not. Okay, it actually looks a lot better on camera. But like looking at it in my mirror, it looks all fuzzy. It's so cute. It's like this tie-dye print and it's got little animals on it. It's a little oversized, but it's super cute. Next, we have another thrift find. This shirt says, you are braver than you think and stronger than Oops. Sorry. Stronger. Stronger than you seem and smarter than you think. One of my favorite, one of my favorite Winnie the Pooh quotes. My other favorite Winnie the Pooh quote is, Piglet, how do you spell love? You don't spell it. You feel it. So it's just a gray shirt. It has... Pooh and Piglet on it. Which is funny because my favorite Winnie the Pooh character is Tigger. And I'm a Piglet. In in terms of Winnie the Pooh, in terms of Pooh characters, I think I'm a Piglet trying to be a Tigger. That one was super cute. I think like that one. This is Disney brand. This is size medium. Next we have a... I needed... For Easter, I decided I needed Easter clothes. You know, I already had Easter dresses, but whatever. I didn't even end up doing anything for Easter. Didn't see my dad or anything. And we didn't really celebrate here. I mean, here Easter is giving the kids Easter baskets. It's about the extent of Easter here. I didn't see my dad for Easter. So I got this one. This is a celebrate Easter. XL from Walmart. I like the other one I got better. But I thought the bunnies were kind of cute. Because as you guys know, I've had an obsession with bunnies lately. If you see my videos. This shirt I got from, I want to say, Romwe. Might have been Shan. I don't know, guys. Some of these are hard to tell, like Romwe and Shan. Because a lot of times, like, you buy stuff from Romwe and it'll have Shen labels on it, or you'll buy it from Shen with Romwe labels. Because they sell a lot of the same stuff because they're sister sites. So I don't know. Just go look 
it should be in one of my haul videos from Mom when you were young. This is a crop top. It's checkered. Red and black on one side, white and black on the other. The sleeves are yellow and black, and blue and black. Wait, wait, it's super cute, it's a medium. I really like that one. I mean, they're not too short. Crop tops really aren't crop tops out of me. They like come just below my belly button. This next shirt I got off of Wish. I love these style shirts. This is a Zoel. I don't, this is not tell me what size it is. But I, these are Kawaii style shirts and I absolutely, I have a whole series of these. I want to get the rest in the series. They're super cute. This is what the front looks like. It says whatever bitch on it. And hello, honey. Got the cute little Kawaii bear. And here's the back. Looks like the back is totally different. They are a little bit see-through, but not bad. Um, I made a mistake one day of wearing this to the daycare. They blew me on the first They said, hello, bitch on it. Uh, whatever, bitch on it. Make hmm. sure, again. I got some bag of free stuff off of Marketplace. This is another, I don't know. This is from Twirl, Brand Twirl. This is again a 14, 16. Says, Daddy's my superhero, which being a little, I thought was super appropriate, and it's purple. My baby girl's favorite color. Queen Bee loves, Queen Bee absolutely loves color purple. This shirt, I have no clue where I got this from. I want to say I got it from Forever 21, but I didn't. I honestly don't remember because it kind of looks like the shirt I showed you from Forever 21. It's a size medium. It's Derek Hart. It's um, crop top. It's a little stripey. It looks similar to the one I showed you earlier from Forever 21. I honestly don't remember where I got that from. We have another shirt, I think, from Romley. Or Shein, if I can find the top of it. Yeah, there's no tag in this. I think it's just... Yeah. It says Shein on it. It might be from Romley. I don't really know, like I said. I'm going to get up in one of my hauls. This is a size medium. This is sheer. It's half hot pink, half plaid. It is a crop top. Careful what bra you wear under it. I tried to wear a hot pink bra under it. Yeah, no. Didn't work. Hurry up. Next, we have another Kawaii style shirt from Wish. This is, again, the Wow brand. The back is plain, but here's the front looks like. I love this. It says Larry and Close Off, Sassy, XLXO, Don't Touch, OMG. And I guess the back does have a design on it. It has like the strippy design on the back. The rest of it's plain. It's not super cute, right? We have a, my last kawaii shirt, I believe. Yeah, it's in the last one. Again, from Wish. Again, Zoel brand. It says, let's get weird. Hello, America. No, it says, let's get something weird. I don't know. No, yeah, it says let's go weird, sorry. 
So that's the front one side. This is the back looks like. It is very oversized, very comfy. Um, highly recommend. They are mildly see through, but not bad. Sorry, guys. I'm overheating. Next thing I got is another shirt I got a couple years ago from Walmart. Technically, I put this in a t-shirt. It's technically not a t-shirt, but it's not a tank top. It's like a halter. Or it's like a halter top. This is from No Bounds. No Boundary, sorry. Mm, this is a medium. It's lacy. It's got straps like this. It's got frillies down the bottom. It's super cute. Um, it is not see-through, it is lined on the inside. Super cute, super comfortable. Walmart. Next, we have another shirt I believe I got from Walmart. Yeah, this is only no boundaries. Size small, this one is from Walmart. Um, it is only see-through up to there. The rest of it is not see-through. It's lined. Buttons in the back. It's got that little keyhole in the back. So, super comfortable, super cute. I think, I can't remember which one I wore for my birthday. Maybe that one. Next shirt I have is another shirt from Walmart. I apparently really like Walmart shirts. This is from the kids section. This is that celebrate easter brand xl shirt this is somebody sweet and it's got little ice cream bunnies on it which is super cute um i got a matching two matching skirts so funny shirts next we have another shirt hmm this one i think i got off of poshmark this is a xl doesn't tell me 1460. Doesn't tell me what the brand is, but it says happier than a unicorn eating cupcakes on a rainbow. I got rid of most of my unicorn shirts, so I did keep this one. Super cute. And then my so just to check guys, any of my clothes that are small, medium, or large are typically from teen sections. The from Walmart and obviously it's from the adult section or from side below sorry if they're xl 1416 then they're from kids sections as i mentioned i get a lot of my clothes from kids sections and this next one I'm trying to picture where i believe i got this from romwe yeah this definitely is wrong yeah. this is a medium this is i'm obsessed with these color black shirts so it's hot pink my favorite color <laughs> blue and then i'm not a fan of this ugly orange color it's cute. It's oversized. I mean, it's really lightweight. I mean, like lightweight enough. It's super comfy. The next one. This one, I, we have no clue where this shirt came from. It ended up in our laundry one day. We had a bunch of mysterious clothes that showed up in our laundry. Um, a couple of them we think might have been from my boyfriend's brother's girlfriend here on maternity clothes. This has no tag on it. This says we can't all be princesses. Someone has to clap when, when I walk by. Which was kind of cute. And I've seen shirt that just before that I had thought about getting. Didn't get, so I kept this one. Like I said, French mysterious clothes. Couple, no, well, Arrow post style shirts that I donated. A couple of maternity things I donated. I bought a really cute, I had to donate this really cute maternity shirt I bought for my girlfriend because she was carried. This next shirt I believe is Wonder Nation from Walmart, right? This is a Wonder Nation, it's from Walmart. And it says dinosaurs on it, it says herbivore, carnivore, omnivore, omnivore. 
Which one are you guys? Are you guys? Comment down below if you're an herbivore, a carnivore, an omnivore, or an omnivore. I'm. I don't know. That's a tough one for me because I don't eat pork or beef. Do we have this one? Again, sparkles don't come off. Next, we have this shirt that I that I had been seeing all over my troll group I'm in, and every time I went, they never had it. This is from Daddy's Work. This is a good luck troll brand. From Daddy's Work. The Daddy finally found it for me. Got it for me, which is pretty exciting. Again, a little big, but it looks super cute with like a shirt under it. Long sleeve shirt underneath. Oh, this next one, I'm not going to show you. This is one of the ones, because it has my actual name on it. And we don't do that, obviously, on here. I don't, I go by my little name, Poppy Rain. So, my girlfriend got me this one. I don't know if it was off of like. It's one of the ones that you see on, like, Facebook all the time that has, like, your name and, like, what your name means and whatever. Like that one's super cute. Your girlfriend got me that one. Stop playing with the drawer. Oh, I do have one more of these kawaii shirts. This, again, is... No, this one doesn't have a tag on it. I don't know what brand this is. This is from Wish to Emacs Cute. Sweets for the sweet. And Just a bunch of different things. So here's the front looks like super cute. Here's what the back looks like. This one is the most see-through out of all of them. I mean, it's kind of see-through, but I mean, it's not like that bad. I feel like the back of these shirts are more see-through than the front because they don't have pictures on them. So that's super cute. We have that one. And last but not least, we have this one that I just rescued out of the clothes I was going to get rid of. I bought this one off of Wish. No. Sorry. Off of Poshmark. This is from the same brand as that white one. It's the one that had like the white cat on it. This is an XL. I think this is a Walmart brand. I'm not really sure. But that's what that one looks like. It's got sparkles. I think these sparkles do come off though. The mummy cat. So yeah, guys, that's my updated shirt collection, and I will catch you on the flip side. Bye, guys. Bye, bye.